in this video I'll show you how to replace your bifold door sliding guide this thing right here that is broken this is a new one and I'll show you how to put it and uh, remove the older one I'll put a link in the description if you want to get one from Amazon if not just go to your local hardware store okay so the first thing we need to remove this pin from the door if you have uh, some nails or if you have a flathead screwdriver you can insert it there and push down until the pin goes down and you can slide the door out it can be tricky it can take a few seconds but just by doing this here we go the door is out of the way your problem may be different but in my case one of these metal springs went out I don't know where it is and the door kept uh, swinging and not closing properly so we'll have to remove uh, this slider guide completely you see here there's two small slits on each side maybe yours is a bit different but usually they all have these two so small slits if you can take some long pliers like this simply insert them on each side of these uh, small openings press a bit and pull down okay here we go because you see there's two tabs that are locking this guide uh, to not fall you can try using your fingers but with some pliers I found that it's much much easier now it's time to take your brand new one it looks a bit different but honestly it works the same way here it has you see the prongs the small tabs on each side so it has four of them and not two but as I said it it has easy to install and to remove so just press on these tabs to bring them together and this way it will be able to lock in place like this and then push it push the other one so it locks as well sorry if you don't see well but you just need to push it until you hear a click like this so now it's in place it won't fall down and do the same on the other side if there is other prongs that you need to do the same thing so insert one first and then just push the other one with your finger until it clicks so now it's locked in place it's not going anywhere it slides perfectly like this all left to do is to insert the pin right in the middle there so take the door push the pin down again if you have nails you'll be able to push it down like this if not just take a flathead screwdriver bring it closer align it and let it go when you're in the middle between the two springs like this and you're done now the door swings perfectly without any issues and I'm also able to close it like this and yeah it stays closed thanks for watching please leave a like comment down below check the links in the descriptions and I'll see you in the next one